Music Hall of the Air, starring Emil Gillels. A Flight Without Wings. They've heard Gillels play before in the biggest concert halls of the Soviet Union. And the world knows him too. He's won several international prizes. Fighter Trofimovich is a bit late. He was putting on a show of his own with the Luftwaffe. Supplies for Leningrad. During the long, heartbreaking months of Leningrad's ordeal, the people often ran out of the barest necessities of life. Bread, coal, clothing. But the city's supply of courage was never low. Someday when there are no more wars, people will want to know what does a city at war look like. Here it is, Leningrad, after 286 days of siege. A city of heroes, defiant of death, ready to die on their feet because they don't want to live on their knees. Three men of the military Soviet on the Leningrad front, Zhdanov, Gavarov, Kuznetsov, makers of the blueprint, designed for a free Leningrad. Just outside the city, sniper Adilov has a rendezvous with the enemy. Adilov has killed 103. Beg pardon, 104. But his position has been discovered. Time to move. Isaac's Cathedral. <laughs> Heavy guns of the enemy have been pouring incessant torrents of fire and steel into Leningrad. The cannon of the Hun hit the workshop of Printer's Hall and wiped it out. But the immortal story of Leningrad continues to be told in blood, sweat, and ink. They got streets, people, buildings. On this day, a Nazi shell finds a favorite target, a children's home, broken dolls and murdered children. This was Linda. She was on her way to nursery school.
out in the Barents Sea. A Soviet submarine gets a report from aerial reconnaissance. Enemy transport. The crewmen are on their toes. So is motion picture operator Oshurkov. Thank <laughs> you.